A major turning point in Ida's life was in 1892 when her friend Thomas Moss, a Memphis letter carrier and grocer, was lynched after a confrontation with a rival white grocer. When the People's Grocery opened up in a mixed race neighborhood in Memphis called The Curve, it was an instant success. It was not only a grocery store, but it was a sense of pride. However, a man by the name of William Berry, who was the white grocer before the People's Grocery arrived, felt threatened by the store's presence. One day after a racially charged mob grew out of a fight between a black youth and a white youth who were playing marbles near Moss's grocery. When the black youth won the fight, the white youth's father jumped in to defend his defeat. Before long, Calvin McDowell and Will Stewart, who both worked at the People's Grocery, came to the black youth's defense. As the fight went on, the crowd of whites and black gathered at the scene, picking sides based on race. During the melee, William Barrett identified Will Stewart as an assailant and gave Barrett 